So this is just a quick video to show you how to get your silicon from looking like this to this with just a few minutes of work. In fact, virtually no work from yourself. So let's take a look, see how it's done. If you're getting it black on your silicon or on your, your tiles, your grout in your tiles, there's a thing that you might want to try before replacing or trying to scrape out your silicon, redoing it all. As long as your silicon is intact, then this is a good way to start and probably the best way to start. So anytime I've got that problem, I'll use this stuff on the actual uh, silicon and usually it will bring it back to white again, unless it's really, really bad. So if you just got like that, you can see there, it's not, not very pretty. So what, you, what I use is this stuff, um, HG bathroom mold spray, and it is brilliant. Um, so I'm just going to spray that corner, and you can see, we'll see if it, if it brings it back to white or not. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't, but it's only like a fiver or something for that. Uh, I'll put the price up, but it's, it's only a few quid and you know it'll last you for ages it does a great job it smells a bit bleachy but it's like yeah it's great so all you need to do is just it's probably the best way to do it that this is one of the best fixes and that you don't need to do any work except go out and buy this so you just spray it and you can spray it on your your uh, throat as well Give it plenty and then leave it for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, if it's still black, just apply again. Okay, it's pretty much back to white. You just keep applying it until it, it takes it back as far as it will go. Um, I think another, I've done three applications there. It's looking a lot cleaner than it was. Um, and this stuff, you just squirt a few uh, applications on. And it's fine. Um, and just wash it off with water once you're done. Just a wee sprinkling off with the shower head. And that's it. That's it finished. If it doesn't come back to clean again, then you probably want to think about replacing the actual silicon, which is a, a whole different ball game. Or if your your seals compromised in any way, you can tell by uh, if it's not adhered to your tiles properly, or it's not adhered to the bath. Um, there's like gaps uh, along the bottom or along the the top edge. If it's like that, then you need to replace the actual silicon seal. So that's a a, a different different ball game, a different video, but. Uh, in the meantime, that is probably the best method to start with if you've got black silicon or, or if your sorry, if your white silicon's gone black, that is definitely the the best method to start with. Hope it's helpful. And uh, yeah, get yourself a, a top of this. It's cheap and it's uh, it's pretty good. It does smell a bit. It smells very bleachy. Yeah, so you don't want to get any of it on your clothes or your hands or whatever, but as I say, you don't need to touch it, just spray it. And then after 20 minutes or so, just rinse it off. Yeah, and it, it does make a huge difference. And especially the grout, it'll take all that back to white as well. Yeah, and if, you, if it doesn't go white, you can just reapply, keep reapplying it until it, it does. It will reach a point where it doesn't take, it doesn't make any difference, but if it keeps making a difference, just keep putting it on and uh, eventually I will go back to really, really clean. So, hope this is helpful uh, and uh, enjoy some white silicon on your bath.